Hello, my fellow Nigerians. <clears throat> Hear what Atiku is saying. He said, South enjoyed 17 years under OBJ, JEJ, and uh, BAT. Not has a devil. God forbid Tinubu's re election. Forgotten that during the military era, the Northerners are the most head of states that we have in Nigeria. If we should calculate, they not ruled for 37 years while the South is now going to 17. Atiku is very selfish. He's a selfish somebody. Former Vice President Atiku Abubakar has criticized recent uh, statements from the presidency, which implied that uh, President Bola Tinubu would remain in the uh, office until 2031, according to a report by Punch. The statements has uh, brought a significant uh, reaction from Atiku, who was the main opposition candidate in, in the 2023 presidential election. The controversy began when George Akume, the secretary to the government, of the Federation made divisive uh, comments during a television interview. Akume advised Northern politicians with uh, aspirations for the presidency in 2027 to step back and uh, wait until uh, 2031. And they argued that uh, President Tinubu, a Santana, should be given a second term to maintain a balance in the regional leadership. Atiku responded through his media advisor, Paul Libe, expressing a dissatisfaction with the SGF's position and questioned the fairness of a such a stance, pointing out and alleged the imbalance in Nigeria's leadership distribution over the years. Atiku noted that uh, by 2027, the, the, the southern region would have a route Nigeria for a total of uh, 17 years, compared to only 11 years under northern uh, leadership. Since, uh, the North South, since the return to democracy in 1999, his uh, gap, he argued, undermines the principle of uh, equity and uh, fairness in the country's uh, governance. Additionally, Atiku cast doubt on the Tinubu administration's uh, performance, suggesting it, it had not achieved enough to justify a second term and uh, challenge the assumption that uh, Tinubu's uh, govern government had demonstrated the kind of uh, progress of uh, competence required to warrant the re-election. Where then does uh, true equity and uh, fairness reside? By the year 2027, the South would have enjoyed 17 years of uh, leadership, 8 years under Ambassador, 5 years under Jonathan, and uh, 4 years under Tinubu. Why did not would uh, have experienced only 11 years with the Yaradua serving three and the Buhari eight? This resulted in a disparity of uh, six years between the North and the South, casting a shadow over the balance of uh, power. In any case, the power to elect and uh, vote our out their government lies firmly with uh, the Nigerian people and trusted to them upon the government's uh, ability to prove itself worthy of the people's uh, ballot. But as the Trubu government demonstrated that uh, it deserves to be re-elected, the answer, alas, is as uh, clear as uh, the heavens uh, themselves, God forbid, he said. My brothers and sisters, why is it that Atiku is like this? Hmm. He has forgotten the military era.
Let's hear from our people, from the comment section, what they are about to say. One says, you are not sincere. The state of a nation of a no concern to you people, just to be in power without the people feeling your impasse positively. What do you benefit from Tinubu government? Only hunger. Tinubu must not allow again. They should allow another sultanate to rule. Exactly. From governor, senator, now. Why would he complain? Even if Nigeria is dead, provided they are in power, that is what Atiku is after. Why do you omit the military years? Are those not in Nigeria life circle? Says another one. Atiku is suffering from an acute fever and the nightmare. Tell Atiku to add the wasted years of a military rule in Nigeria as led by Army General from the North. God bless your age. Hmm. My brothers and sisters, see what we are saying. Suffering from acute fever and the nightmare. Tell Atiku to add more, to add the wasted years of military rule. Hmm. I never knew that Atiku was a shrewd, naked pin. It is now I knew he reasoned like a, a, an, another, another person. It's not reasoned like a, him himself. From independence, Tafa Balewa, six years. Gowan, nine years. Muritala Mohammed, two years. Shagari, four years. IPB, eight years. Abacha, five years. Yaradwa, two years. Buhari, nine years. Obasanjo, ten years. Shuneko, six months. Jonathan, six years. All together, not 37 years, South 17 years. If this is equity in Atiku's mind, it means he will never rule Nigeria. God will never allow him. Compare 17 to 37 years, Atiku is diseased in the sun. Nigerians should know whom Atiku is and what he represents. Asiku should not rule Nigeria. They should do for another northern. If Tinubu cannot do what Nigerians want. Did Nigeria commence in 1999? It is only hmm, the same man who will push such stupid argument. The wrong foundation which made a democratic government difficult was laid by the North during the military era, says another one. I'm not a supporter of it, but Atiku Gov in this uh, world, not once uh, power, every time a satana is uh, in power. And uh, no satana has uh, desperately want to usurp power from a sitting northern president. This is why Nigeria must be peacefully divided into different uh, countries. They not need to have their own country. And like uh, wise, the Igbos, Yorubas, and the other others, Buhari just left power after eight years of uh, mercy and uh, destructive leadership. Now, if we need a Nathana to rule Nigeria again, it should be, it shouldn't be a Fulani stock, but a, a true uh, Nathana, that is Awusa. The likes of uh, Kwankwasu, Rimi, and others. <clears throat> Very dangerous people, enemy of uh, humanity. They are, that is the Fulanis. Oga, these two people you mentioned are equally Fulani. Hmm. My people, my people. Atiku has no much enemies in PDP. He has too much enemy in PDP and uh, in the North. If he goes into elections, with Tinubu, he will surely lose that. Support is a certain candidate that can be widely accepted instead of a Tinubu or Atiku. 
since 1960, calculate it between north and south. Look at this man bringing a divide and a tribalism into politics. I didn't, I don't blame you. In the 50s, when the south asked for independence, the north said we should go eat. It was as as equal that told us to go after the useless 1966 coup. This same not said they want to go. It was Irosi who begged that uh, we should be together and carried everything to the center, which the not is enjoying today, to the detriment of uh, the South, South, that produces the highest money in this country. Today, you see why the, the law of uh, karma is hitting some people terribly and uh, they are drawing their useless map to include us that the lie you must carry your cross on your own. Atiku will never be the president of uh, this uh, country. If he lies, he can uh, make Obi his uh, junior brother or marry his uh, sister. The only thing he's uh, interested in is how to capture power and loot the country, uh, the country dry. I can never vote for the full army in this country again. My people, this is what our people are saying in the comment section. In the comment section, you can say, you are free to say your own opinion. Subscribe to this channel, share, love and like. God bless Nigeria. Thanks and God bless. Amen.